Welcome to Bardstown. It's the gala at the Kentucky Bourbon Festival, and something pretty special is happening tonight. We're meeting a lieutenant from Kentucky who was the 1,000th person to go through the Bourbon Trail, and in his honor, the governor of Kentucky has shown up. Let's go talk to him. Thanks for being here at the Bourbon Festival for us. What, are you, what's, what brings you here tonight? Well, as a sitting governor in Kentucky, I can't think of a better place to be than the Bourbon Gala, where we're celebrating our signature industry. You know, 95% of the bourbon is made in Kentucky. Bourbon is older than our state itself is, so it's a great place to be. And we're celebrating Lieutenant Hooker's one, it was the 1,001 to go through the trail. That's pretty cool, isn't it? It's pretty cool, and the fact that it is, it is one of, of our own who is going to go to Afghanistan and defend our freedoms, that makes it special, you know, to, to have him go, have gone down the bourbon trail and to, and to celebrate this bourbon experience with uh, thousands of people who have already enjoyed it and thousands more who will. It's very special. Absolutely. You're a bourbon fan, aren't you? I'm a very big bourbon fan. Me too. We've got a lot in common there. Good. Lieutenant Clinton Hooker was the 1,000th person to go through the bourbon trail. You had no idea you were going to be the 1,001. How did you find this out? Uh, actually, my mom sent me a uh, passport. Um, and I thought I was only going to get a free t-shirt. But the next thing I know, I'm getting a call from the Kentucky uh, Distillers. Well, in addition to quite an honor, you've got some pretty cool stuff I've heard this weekend. Yes, yes. What have you got for being um, the thousandth person to the bourbon trail? I've been talking, uh, well, actually, I've met all the uh, master distillers. And they've all, uh, every single one of them has presented me a bottle of their bourbon hand sign. And, um, and I'll, I'll, I've also been uh, given a you know, Kentucky Colonel. You're, you're a colonel now. In addition to being lieutenant, you're a colonel. You've been four times. I didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't ask for that promotion. <laughs> you may get another one before the night's over. Uh, the governor of Kentucky was here also to honor you. Yes. How did, how did that feel? Um, it was actually very honored. Uh, I talked to him a little outside and took pictures with him. And you've always been a, you've always been a bourbon fan? Yes. yes. I, I'm, I'm thinking, are you even more of a bourbon fan tonight than you ever have been? Oh, definitely. <laughs> Without a doubt. <laughs> well, we're naked tonight, Christy. We're doing whiskey sours tonight. I can tell how you. Whiskey sours. Whiskey sours. We're doing Jim Beam Jim Black, Black whiskey, whiskey sours. sours. Lemonade, orange juice, and a splash of water. This is like Christmas for me. Would you like one? Serving Woodford Reserve here at the Bourbon Gala. Mango tea cocktail with Woodford Reserve. It's getting rave reviews already. We're bringing a culture, a people, and a passion together with one blog. Bourbonblog.com We only encourage responsible drinking by those who have legal age to drink in their countries or regions. So be safe, be legal, and never drink and drive.